Yeah, yeah. Uh. Underrated, underrated, we the underdogs, underestimated. Yeah. Underrated, underrated, we the underdogs, underestimated. We the one. This room for a reason, and it's not just to complete an eight-week challenge. There is something in you that is destined to do great, great things. I was so inspired when I learned about the Aspen Challenge years ago in mobilizing students from across the country to accept these challenges and come up with creative solutions to our most urgent national problems, I think is one of the most galvanizing educational initiatives in America. The Aspen Challenge is a blueprint for what we would like to see kids doing more often, which is solving problems, being critical thinkers, uh, being innovative in their solutions, and being leaders in their school. The most underutilized resource in our community are the brains of our young people. And what it does for me is it affirms, again, why we need to continue to invest into the minds of our young people. Giving these kids a opportunity and a platform to come up with solutions to these pressing problems. Uh, and, and we're not just giving you a pat on the back, we're literally giving you resources to help us come up with uh, ideas and solutions to these problems that affect all of us. I think that's very powerful. You know, coming here and realizing that even though it was so much, I have tangible things I can put down on paper and say I did and present and talk to people about is incredibly refreshing. This is one of the first times they've worked on a very real world major project. Uh, we counted. They've spent over 100 hours on this as a team. I can't even imagine how much time they spent on it individually. They've had excellent practice now interacting with lawmakers, interacting with politicians, interacting with other um, people in our community. By the end of the last eight weeks, I think the kids were really, really proud of what they had done. The Aspen Challenge did more to supply me with a voice, to supply me with a platform and a great idea. It was like a Kickstarter, kind of kicked us up the mountain and now we're going up ourselves. My hope for the Aspen Challenge and its impact on Louisville is that we as a city uh, recognize what is happening here, that this has catalyzed a new process of youth engagement, that we are able to have an ongoing problem-solving machine that the Aspen Challenge has provided a framework to get us started with. It's a great learning experience. Uh, it lets you know what you can do, and it really lets you know who you are and opens your eyes to what's out there in the world. Too often in the traditional school setting, the teacher is the keeper of all knowledge and the teacher is the sage on the stage. Uh, but the Aspen Challenge has allowed our teachers to relinquish some of their authority in the classroom to create learning experiences for the students to have agency and voice and choice in the learning. I think that oftentimes some students can kind of exist within their own head and they might have great ideas, but they feel like uh, they don't have a, a platform to let those out. Uh, and I think we really empowered kids and just gave them confidence and said, you can do it. I mean, I think that's what so much of the Aspen Challenge has been to this point, and they've done it, they did it. One of the many things that I wanted to take away is that there are a lot of people out there that are rooting for them, that they can be the next mentors or the next supporters of others that are in need as they move forward in their lives. What I saw after, when they were announced winners, was something that I'll never forget in my life. I saw them talking to their parents afterwards in Spanish, Mom, we did it. Uh, one young lady said, now I see what I can do. The kids are on fire for life. I feel like this changed me in a way that 
school couldn't change me, it was college didn't change me. It taught us persistence and it taught us dedication. And I think that that's really going to be something that I can use in my everyday life. And it's going to be something that I'm going to take with me. Oh yeah, I'm ready for anything that's thrown at me. These eight weeks have been something that I've never experienced before. I feel like I can do anything. We're going to I'm engaged. I'm inspired. I'm ready to lead.